with no place to go. Let it snow, let it snow. Good morning, guys. I'm back looking better than ever. What's happening? Today is my birthday. Happy birthday to me. It's my 26th birthday. It's November 30th, the last day of November. And I just wanted to take you guys along with me on my birthday. Alex and I are going to Boston today. You guys are truly my friends. So I obviously like need to spend my birthday with my best friend. You know what I mean? Can I just tell you how happy I am with one of the birthday presents Alex got me? It's this really long like huggy thing. It's like a hoodie that's a blanket. So I'm wearing a blanket. I got these for my parents for like both of their, oh, for Mother's Day and Father's Day. And I was like so jealous when I gave it to them because I'm like, dang it, I want one. And now I have one. Um, so I'm gonna hurry up and get ready because I'm already running super late. I, I was supposed to be about seven. I woke up at like eight. Let's get in the vlog. Vlogger. So the first step was putting on my spa treatment eye patches, which I've talked about so much on my channel, but they're these guys right here. They are so bomb, especially like if you don't get a lot of sleep the night before and your eyes are really puffy. They help it so that it'll take away any puffiness, but then they also just like waken you right up. I love these whenever I'm getting ready early in the morning and like when my face is still pretty puffy. And then I just went ahead and like was like touching up my curls with my T oh, T3 curling iron. I'm gonna see if I can, I guess I'll just go on the floor. Honestly, I did most of my hair. I forgot to pull out the camera, but I'm just working on the last pieces. Literally nothing special. I just sectioned it off and was wrapping my hair around. I hold it for like 14 seconds. Or actually a little bit less since I already curled my hair yesterday. I'm just trying to reform some of them. Every time I curl my hair, Choka is like right here. Like yesterday I was standing up curling my hair and he was sitting like laying down right in front of the mirror. He is just such a needy little boy. Right, Papu? He knows that we're both getting old. Do you know it's my birthday, Choka? Oh, that's a yes. Sometimes I want to cut my hair to like this length right here, like the length of my top layer. And I feel like it would look cute. Oop, I curled my bang the wrong way. Why are you leaving me, dude? It's my birthday. <laughs> this little diaper in the camera so we need to get ready but we need to get ready kind of fast so i'm gonna put my clips in i keep getting distracted because i'm the type of person that has to respond to every single birthday message right away because i hate things um pending i'm just so popular so i get so much love i'm just kidding but did i do my yeah i already did vitamin c so now i'm just gonna put on a bunch of my keels ultra facial moisturizer i'm gonna glob this on because it is cold outside I need to hurry up and get ready though because I still don't even know what I'm gonna wear. I forgot I was recording. All right, so right now I'm just putting on my e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer because this always makes me feel so good. It smooths out all of my wrinkles. Just kidding. Oh my gosh, my camera's already done. All right, guys, we are ready. I didn't even get to show you guys my outfit, my full outfit, but I'll insert pictures of everything I'm wearing. Alex and I are twinning with the red because he was asking me a couple days ago what I wanted to wear for my birthday and I said, I don't know, all I want is a red hat and red mitten. <laughs> and so he got me a red hat and mittens for my birthday or part of my birthday gift. But yeah, now we're heading to downtown Boston and we're gonna go ice skating. I already talked about all this. We're gonna have some food, go to like little shops and stuff. So I'm so excited. I will vlog more once we are there. It's about a two hour car ride. Oh yeah, this is how my makeup came out too. Not too shabby. Books and communicates and um, has seminars on walking by faith. But most people are deprived of talking by faith. Continue. All right, so I'm a terrible vlog vlogger. I haven't really vlogged anything because I've just been really present. Look how cute we are matching. But we did some damage, show them the bags. I finally got a pair of Lululemons. Yeah, it's one bag, I put them all inside. Oh, okay, so it doesn't look like we did that much. Alex condensed all the bags. But I got some Lululemons, or Alex bought me some, and then I went. Oh, is it this way? Yeah. Okay. Oh, um, yeah, I got a couple things from Zara too. I'll show you guys when I get home. And then we went to Aritzia. 
I was gonna get the Aritzia Milena pants, but Alex says he doesn't like the way I look in leather pants. I'm just kidding. He just said it wasn't worth $150, so we didn't get those, and he got me Zulu lemons instead. And now we're gonna walk around this really cute park, and then we're gonna go to dinner after that. But I really wanted to go to this park because it's all decorated with Christmas lights. Look at all the Christmas. I'm gonna vlog a little bit there, but I just wanted to fill you guys in. This is the best birthday ever. Thumbnail. Take it away from me. So I just got home. The lighting in here is probably garbage, but I want to show you guys what I got and kind of update you guys. So Alex and I, we went to dinner. We went to uh, one of my favorite restaurants. It was not that it's nothing special, but it's like a chain restaurant, but it's so cute and so nice in there. It's Maggiano's. They had it decorated like so cute for Christmas, and it's just like one of my favorite restaurants that my family would always go to for special occasions, for birthdays. We always had annual Christmas dinners there, and so I feel like that restaurant, it just, it holds so many memories. So I love going there. So we went there for my birthday. It was so good. And then after that, we, Alex went to Gap and got some sweatpants. Then we came home. Oh, then we stopped at Burger King because we were both craving cookies and cream milkshakes. So those are in the freezer right now. We'll probably have that with cake later. Unrelated, but I wanted to show you guys what I got for my birthday. And look at what this is. Alex got me one of those like light up LED lights that says Janelle Marie's for like, I can put this in my beauty room and it's like a nice pink magenta. Literally so beautiful. I don't want to pick move it around too much because I don't want to break it But I was so excited about that. They are super expensive And so it was one of those things where I always wanted but like I just like you don't want to get for yourself You don't want to spend I think it was like almost 200 bucks For a light, but if somebody else gets it for you, you're like ecstatic. That's the right word Ecstatic I think that's it. Anyway, then he got me this really cute oversized flannel because he knows how much I love oversized flannels and i love that it has like the red throughout it and it also has like a muted gray and a muted almost like beigey gray so i love this from zara this is what i got then when we went to zara it wasn't the biggest zara they had a lot of cute stuff i feel like right now i just am really wanting to get basic pieces i'm like good in the tops department cute tops i have it all but in reality like cute tops aren't what i'm grabbing for right now like i need more layering pieces i need more like coats and blazers and like stable basics but they didn't have that many options there but i did find really cute trousers i've been wanting some like muted just like beige trousers to wear with like a knit sweater like this or a basic top or even like a cute top and they're in this like really pretty beige material, slightly pleated. I didn't get to try them on in Zara. I was worried they would be a little bit too small. I'm scared to try them on right now because I just had so much pasta. <laughs> I got them in an extra small, we'll see. And then I also got this top because I've been obsessed. Kind of like Hunter's green color. And it's this really nice stretchy material. I figured this would be nice to layer under sweaters. I could even wear this with like a blazer and then a coat over top. And yeah, I just really loved the color of this, especially with like chunky necklaces on top. And this was only $12.90. And then the trousers were $45. Alex got me some Lululemons, which I was so excited about because again, it's one of those things where like you don't want to buy for yourself. Or at least I didn't want to spend $100 on leggings. But like if it's your birthday and somebody wants to treat you to it, what's going on with my hair? You're like all on board for it. At first I was like, what's the hype? I tried them on. They feel a lot like my airy leggings, but they're thicker and they're like aligned better so the issue that i have with my airy leggings is that they're so comfortable i love to wear them around the house but even whenever i film like vlogs and i'm walking around like you can definitely see more of the cellulite peeking through which is fine 
but if you can get a legging that like smooths everything out and just like snatches your body i'm all about it so i tried them on and i was like dang these really do smooth everything out and then i asked alex what he thought and he was like yeah you look real. you like your body looks really good in those you gotta get them so i was like gotta get them if my husband thinks they look cute i got the align leggings i got them in a size two which they look tiny but they stretch out a lot and then i figured the two would still like suction everything in really nice i don't know what material they use but it just like really just smooths everything out so i'm really excited about those because then i can finally wear them with like cropped shirts and stuff and um not have to like worry about my butt looking all crazy and then this little chunky knit sweater i got for myself at target i thought it was so cute um super super warm and i just had my aritzia like it's just like kind of like a thermal top underneath of it and i this was like so warm it was like 30 degrees outside we were walking around like crazy and it was perfect and then i have these pants that i got from h&m last year which to be honest i don't like them like this like the zipper feels weird but i love the tone of these pants and i feel like just like peeking out underneath of my coat that covers most of the outfit it worked and then i just had on my steve madden cream booties which were i'll pop in a picture here they were so comfortable like we were walking around like crazy and my feet did not hurt they give you height i love them so much and then this is a christmas present for my sister-in-law and her boyfriend so i'm not going to show you that we had so much fun today this was truly one of the best birthdays ever like of all time and me for my birthdays i always get like really sad for one i used to hate growing up like you can to get scared of getting old and all that but for one i had this whole new revelation honestly the last couple years of just like appreciating who god's molded me into each year and recognizing that i would never want to go back to who i was a year ago two years ago three years ago like i'm just so proud of how much i've grown and the woman i'm becoming and the confidence that i'm developing in myself that it's like i would never want to reverse time like i'm so happy of all the knowledge i gain each year and that just makes me so excited to go into a new year with new wisdom and a new perspective so that was like note number one of just what just made me so excited for this birthday and then two like not setting up crazy expectations and truly spending your birthday with like people that you truly love i feel like in the past i would either try to make crazy plans or get upset if like friends wouldn't reach out to me or you know want to do anything crazy on my birthday and just like really simplifying it and just really like making the day doing what you love to do what do i love to do shop and hang out with alex and so just having this like really chill day with just us and just like connecting with him like we had such a good time why is, why was i about to cry and it was like one of the best birthdays ever just doing like just such chill stuff so i'm excited i love this I used to be terrified of getting old, but I, I'm like, I love the amount of confidence and love that I have for myself right now that I never had in my early 20s. This is amazing. So if you're scared of getting old, just know as long as you shift your mindset and you appreciate the woman that you're becoming, there's so much more love that you gain for yourself the older that you get. Okay, that was like a whole rant. I guess I'll end the vlog here depending on how long this is. I love you guys. I'm going to be doing way more vlogs and content and all that because I have so many Christmas plans set. I'm gonna do kind of like a vlogmas so stay tuned for that definitely consider subscribing i love you guys so much see you guys next time bye